I'm just hanging out with my buddy over here. Uh, I'm actually trying to get some milk. And uh, I got kind of bored of doing it the old fashioned way. So I decided to do it our way. The Lucky Nation style. <laughs> um, but you know. Oh, look at that. Hey. We are falling. It just looked like uh, we were just floating. <laughs> That's pretty funny. But um, yeah, if you want to see how I do this, um, I'll go ahead and show you. It's obviously more dangerous, but once you get the hang of it, uh, it's fairly easy. Um, I did put down some sleeping bags so that way if I do die, you know, I can still make my way back. But I'll show you how this is done. Alright, so here I have, and I like to do this with fires, guys. I don't like to do it with uh, lightnings. Definitely not lightnings because you will die. I mean, the odds are pretty high. So I stop real quick. And I... What the heck? Since when can they uh, light your, <laughs> your fires on fire? Right? I mean... Is this like uh, some kind of new change or what the heck? Because when I was on it, uh, you know, I don't get hurt. But uh, when I'm off it, it gets hurt. That's weird. But anyways, I use uh, my Wyvern as bait. And then I do like to either go towards the tail or the head. But if you are on the head, make sure that you let off enough. Because otherwise you're going to be getting um, lit up or it's going to bite you. But if you're far enough, then uh, you won't get hurt at all. And also, if you get too close to it, and let's say you're on the tail, it will keep on going up higher and higher until it reaches the very top. And if you don't take it down before it reaches the very top, you will automatically die. So I like to go towards the head most of the time. Uh, of course, obviously, sometimes you can't. But this one, uh, it shouldn't take long. Especially if they're lower levels. But see, this is uh, the perfect uh, length to be away from it because uh, you, uh, it doesn't uh, light you up. As you can see, it barely misses. If you get too low, then it starts going in circles uh, downwards. If you get too close to it, it goes up. So, you know, if you get it just right, uh, it just stays there and it goes in circles. It doesn't go up or down, which is kind of nice. Now, um, a lot of times you have to keep on shooting it just because, uh, you know, as a lot of you know, the torpor does go down quite fast. it's already about halfway and I'm gonna need time to run because uh, for whatever reason my wyvern decided to keep on walking and see there it is it's still walking away uh, I guess it, it's mad because I guess it's tired of uh, getting hurt <laughs> when I do these these things I mean at least it looks like it's uh, going on strike doesn't want to do this anymore just left me behind but that yeah that was pretty much it guys I mean it's it's nice and simple easy you don't need a trap but like I said uh, you know it's no different than the giga the, this is dangerous and until you get the hang of it you know it's it may be rough but it is pretty fun I mean I find it more fun anyway but uh, yeah hopefully it'll let me get back on its back uh, I think she's kind of pissed off at me right now but but that's pretty much it. So, yeah, this is uh, how to uh, get milk the uh, Lucky Nation style. So, till next time, keep surviving. My work saved the human race.